Okay, today, boys and girls, we're going to review or go over our um, vowel sounds again. Vowels can be really tricky and sneaky, especially some of them. So real quick, if you have your vowel shield, go ahead and pull that out because you're going to want to use that today. Um, the ones that are the trickiest that I find with you guys when you're writing is the I and the E. So today we're going to spend a lot of time listening for those I's and the E's. Okay? What sound does I make? I says I. And it's really easy to make that sound all by yourself when you're just making that one sound. But when you put it in a word, sometimes it can be sn sneaky and it can sound like an E. What sound does E make? Yep, E says eh. All right, so today we're going to play a game. But to get us warmed up and to get our ears warmed up, to listen for our special vowels, we're going to sing a song. Okay, this is a song that I know that you guys sang when you were at school. I'm going to zoom in for us just a little bit. All right, it's called, What's the Middle Sound That You Hear? All right, so I've got a couple pictures. All right, I have an easy one to warm us up with. This is a, this is a picture of a trash can, like trash. Okay, so this is how the song goes. All right, do y'all remember? What's the middle sound that you hear, that you hear, that you hear? What's the middle sound that you hear in trash, trash, trash? So let's say that word really slow. Tra. And let's get our vowel sound. Vowel shield. What's that? Yep, A. Great job. So here we go. Ah is the middle sound that you hear, that you hear, that you hear. Ah is the middle sound that you hear <clears throat> in the word trash. Okay, so you ready for another one? I think I got a frog in my throat or something. All right, here we go. What's that a picture of? Which? Great job. It has a ch sound at the end, but we're not listening for the ch sound. We're listening for that middle sound. So y'all ready? Here we go. Which? Ready? What's the middle sound that you hear? That you hear? That you hear? What's the middle sound that you hear in which? 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 To so say that word, which, which, okay, this is that tricky one. Is it e like egg or is it I like igloo? Sometimes you have to think because you just want to make it say the S sound, but it's not wetch, right? So which one is it? Hi, that's right. I is the middle sound that you hear, that you hear, that you hear. I is the middle sound that you hear in the word which. All right, let's do one more. All right. Let's see, what is this one? That's a vest. That's right, you ready? Vest. Say it really slow. Vest. What's the middle sound that you hear? That you hear? That you hear? What's the middle sound that you hear? In vest, vest, vest. You ready? Do y'all know it? Is it eh like igloo or eh like egg? You're right, eh. Here we go. Eh is the middle sound that you hear, that you hear, that you hear. Eh is the middle sound that you hear in the word vest. Okay, so now we're ready to go, all right? So I have a special game for you. Yesterday, or the last time we got together, we played this game. Have you been playing it at home? Did you find something with four syllables in it? Did you send a picture to your teacher? Great job. All right, today I have a new game for you. It kind of is, it's kind of like that. But this time, it's called the vowel hunt. And what your job today is, is you're going to get a grown-up or your brother or sister, and you're going to have them tell you a vowel sound. And you're going to have them, um, and you're going to go around and find something that has the vowel sound in the middle. right? And then you're going to write or spell it. And then you're going to have them say a different vowel sound. So I don't have little kids at home. Mine are big boys and girls. Um, they're Braden and Bradley are 13. But they had fun playing this game with me today. I told them that they were going to have a competition to see who could find a word first. It's always fun to play this game with somebody else and kind of like race around the house to see who can find it first. So this is what we did. I gave them a vowel. I said, find something in the house that says eh in the middle. What vowel says eh? Which one of our vowels makes that eh sound? E, you're right. Okay, so they ran around. I counted them off. I said, one, two, three, go. And they ran around the house trying to find something with the eh sound in the middle. 
And Briley came back with this. Do y'all know what that is? And it's a belt. That's Mr. Danny's belt, right? And so then I said, so we picked a vowel. She found something. Now it's time to spell it and write it. So we wrote it, all right? Can y'all help me write the word belt? All right, if you have your dry erase board and marker, let's go. What's the first sound? B, right? B, eh, hmm. What's that? Eh, like egg. Great job, guys. B, L, T, belt. And see, it has the S sound in the middle. All right, you ready? So then after we did that, and then step four is to give them a different sound. So I did that. I gave them another sound. I said, go and find something in the house that has the I sound. Hmm. Which one says I? Yep. Well, so they ran around the house and it was a competition and Briley came back with something and it didn't have the I sound. It sounded like the I sound, but it was, it was E. Eh. And it was tricky. And she's like, man. So she had to put it down. But Brayden found this. Do y'all know what this is? This is a clip. Ready? And so I said, all right, spell it for me. So he did. Cl, cl. Ooh, that's a blend like we were learning about last week. Cl, I, P, clip. All right, great job. And then I gave him another one. And so I said, all right, now... Go and find something that says, uh. And so they went and they found, one of them found this. It's a cup, all right? You can also play it where you go and you find vowels because remember vowels can make two sounds. So A can say a, ah, like apple, or it can say A, like ape. E can say E, eh, like egg, or E, like eagle okay so each vowel has two sounds so you can tell a grown-up to go and tell you to find something in your house that has the a sound and it has to make the a all right so you can play either way but what i want you to do most is i want you to have fun and i want you to play this game with your mom and dad and have fun practicing writing and hearing those sounds today when you get done playing this game you will also have um uh, activity in your Google Classroom to do. All right, boys and girls, have fun, play hard, play lots of learning games, and know that your teachers love you. Bye, kiddos.